I think, in my opinion, there's a lot of tools already available. People just need to learn about how to use those tools and then implement it in their business. It seems to me that the price is going down and the sophistication is going down. But there is Actually, a need yeah. for some level of, uh, like if you want to do it with your hands, there's some need for, for some level of education. So uh-huh. um, what type of education you think it should be taken by the small business to implement no-code AI? Uh, what should they become good at? Yeah, so if you look at uh, one example I can give you, there's a, uh, there's a company called Bubble. It's based out of New York, but it's one of the most popular no-code uh, no code web app builders. But if you, you know, if as a business owner, you started to try to use it, it would be very difficult for you to understand if you didn't have experience with that. The same thing applies to Photoshop. I mean, in Photoshop, there's no code, right? But you cannot just jump into it and start doing amazing things. You still, it's still a tool that you have to learn how to use. Uh, as far as finding what tools you should use, there's already a number of, there's a lot of resources on the internet that allow you to basically search use cases or search keywords, and they give you a no-code tools based on your requirements. But you would still have to look at the tool and look at some, uh, some documentations as far as how to use it. What would be the future? Well, what's going to happen next? Five yeah, I mean, now, so... If you come back, what's different? Yeah, so if you look at the internet in 2000, I mean, the internet had all the capabilities... Uh, for somebody to build Facebook in 2000, right? So it was doable back then, but they didn't do it until, what, 2007? So it took them quite some time to get used to the technology and then find use cases to to build something meaningful. Um, And I think AI is fairly new. And it used to be that the cost of AI was pretty high. It's coming down rapidly. And so it opens up doors to a lot more people to test out different ideas. Um, it's very difficult for me to say exactly what things are going to look like in five years. Um, but I think a lot more businesses are going to realize the importance of AI and start using it. I think, in my opinion, there's a lot of tools already available. People just need to learn about how to use those tools and then implement it in their businesses. I think there's no shortage of amazing technology out there. So it's just a matter of business owners going out and trying to find uh, solutions that fit their use cases. Thank you.